improve your game with lessons from the best in the business. Golf Magazine. Call now. Wrestling fans, welcome to another edition of PWF Pro Wrestling TV. As always, I'm your host, Brian Regal, along with... I'm Rob Dimension, and this week we're not at the usual PWF Studios, as you can see. This week we're at the IWA Cruel School, located in Boyertown, PA, where they issue the challenge to anybody who thinks they got what it takes to call the number. You know who has what it takes? The fallen angel, Christopher Daniels. He took Chris Devine's United States title just five days ago at Explosion. New champion, Brian. Not to mention Jay Briscoe. Did you see what happened there? He didn't even make it to the ring. I mean, it was it was terrible. Jay Briscoe getting laid out. And Quiet Storm had a... What a surprise he had. I mean, sometimes you gotta watch what you wish for, because you just may get it. And you sure got it at Explosion, Rob. I tell you what, Brian. It was a nightmare. It was terrible. Gino Giovanni back in the PW. Just when you thought you got rid of that, that's you know about it. It's not even worth talking about. I'm gonna go talk to somebody right now and see if I can fix this problem before it even gets too far. Fans, put your seatbelts on, strap in. We're gonna have a great week of PWF Pro Wrestling action. Been away a month. I got all my that's paperwork, magazines, computers not even hooked up. A lot of work here too. Hey Karina, what's it been? Three weeks, man? I'm not in the presidency already and Giovanni's back again? What's going on with this? Hello Rob, how are you doing? Hey Steve, how are you doing? Welcome back. You know, I know you've been in Japan for a week. I know you've been in Australia for a week. Oh, by the way, congratulations on being the new number one contender and going against Hamrick at WrestleBowl. Yeah, congratulations. But, dude, this is important. It's been, what, six months? He's been beating me down. You guys never did anything about it. Now, all of a sudden, you guys let him back in? What's going on? Bro, I just got into the office. What do you want me to do? Bro, I've been away for weeks. I've been away for a month. You know, it, it's night. It's 7.30 at night. And you're, you're on me. I'm, I'm here at night. I have a son at home, Rob. What do you want me to do? I want something to be done. This is It's just not going to work. Rob, we agreed a couple months ago that we need to have a president that's going to be a matchmaker and do all of the stuff at the show. You wanted to work on promotions. Brian works on stuff for the website. I'm always in Japan. You know, so that's why we picked Charlie. So he could be the president. He could do all this stuff. Why are you Why are you bothering Charlie? Why aren't I? Yeah. Where's he at? I don't look right. I just got a Are you here? Let me, you know, I'll leave a voice message for him. You have his number. What do you want me to do? Look what I got. I got formats here. Look, you know what, man? Matches. You finish up doing what you're going to do because... I gotta, I gotta call somebody. Hey, I didn't even know Chris Daniels won the U.S. title. When is somebody gonna tell me this, Rob? Unbelievable stuff. I'll do. I'll tell you something else. I'm, you know, I'll be happy to wrestle Chris Hamrick at Wrestle Bowl for the Universal Heavyweight Title. But you know, well, Gino Giovanni back is not my business. Talk to Charlie. He's the president. I'm gonna go. Let's go, baby. It's so easy. Hot local babes want to party with you. Call 1-800-820-HOT for just 69 cents per minute. Wild local babes are waiting to connect with you right now. It's so wild. You've got to check. 
Jacket Out. Hi, I'm Cindy Thompson for Rad, recording artists, actors, and athletes against drunk driving. Real life is not always a song, and in less time than it takes to play the latest country hit, someone will be injured or killed in an alcohol-related crash. So next time you're out with someone who's been drinking, don't let them take the wheel. Take the keys instead. Friends, don't let friends drive drunk. This party isn't all that it's cracked up to be. It may be cold outside, but it's sizzling in here. Share steamy conversation with girls that are sweet yet wild. Pick up the phone now and call 1-800-WE-ARE-18. Just $250 to $5.99 per minute for adults only. Or visit us at weare18.com. Listen or take a peek. Anything can happen. Play Team V or Lucky If you could see plaque clogging your arteries, you'd floss them. If you could see a cramped heart muscle, you'd massage it. If you could see a blood clot, you'd wash it out. If you could see inside yourself, you'd talk to your doctor about heart disease. It's the number one killer of women. Find out your risk and act now to lower it. The hard truth is, taking care of yourself starts from the inside out. To learn more, call this number. Rob, it didn't look like you had much success getting any answers from Steve Perino about this Giovanni situation. No, I'm, I'm going to call the president right now. Who are you calling? Uh, call him Lagrand. Lagrand, yeah. Well, he calls Lagrand. Yeah, let's Rob. talk about what you're going to see tonight on Trump. PWF Pro Wrestling it's TV. It's you're going to see two of England's premier superstars, yeah. it's Johnny dimension. Storm and Joe oh. Fleisch. They're putting on a match of the year candidate right it's, here in the PWF. Hello? Is he, see if you can. Sorry. Also on tonight's show, we well, have Lockdown and Potsdam, which is one of the most brutal matches ever in PWF history. No, These guys put themselves, they didn't even care what they did themselves. It was crazy. Where do you see this match? What, you want to talk? I want to talk to him. Is he, can you hold on, let me put this guy back. I hope. While he finishes up hey, with Charlie, team, let's yeah, take a look at Quiet Storm, one of the wrong. most talked about wrestlers on the scene today. Let's go back hey, to Lockdown and Potsdam and see how he won the that's junior heavyweight title. Wait a second. Charlie? Hello? I think we lost the signal. Let's go to the ring. We only have 90 seconds. It's very hard to take somebody out. Like you would know. I could take you out in 10. And I'd have 80 seconds to hang out with Allison Danger. Nice roll through by Quiet Storm. Ray with the leg scissors takeover. Goes for the spin kick block. Nice Mexican arm drag. Rolls, rolls over. Both men face off. I think it's the other half of the team that's formerly going to be known as the Roxies. Formerly. That was formerly known as the Roxies. Yeah. If I was Adam, I'd just stay outside the ring. And what happens if you just climb under the ring for 90 seconds? I guess you can get away with it. There's only one rep out here. It's a good finish. I have to use that sometime. See, this is what I was talking about. Adam Flash is in a bad position right now. Smart move. They're working on the bigger man. Where's Doomsday? Doomsday should be out here for moral support. He's busy celebrating with a 40 or something. Well, he's not celebrating Flash. with Adam because Flash is out here right now. I'm sure they'll go get some rats tonight. From Adam Flash. Look at that. High elevation. That is some serious strangler part of Adam Flash. Check out the impact on that suplex. Here comes CT Cruz. Triple C. Yeah, that's his new name. Like 3D, 3C. There's no 3D anymore, but there now is a 3C. Take my necklace. Head scissors take over by Red. Oh, Red gets draped across the top turnbuckle. Reverse roll up. No, he rolls through into a German. Wow. Suplex, no bridge. Red counted it 
first. No hope on the second. GT Cruz impressive here in his first few moments in the BWF. C, triple C, and out of flash, looks like they're teaming up. Don't they know it's not uh, through the ropes elimination here? Well, so what? They're trying to get the guy out of the ring so they can isolate Red. Red's a champion. You get Red out, you know there's going to be a new champion. She's a penny pen. Springboard's over the attempted double clothesline. Oh, oh! Takes them both out of the ring. Triple C, Chi-Chi Cruz out of flash outside the ring. These guys got... Hey, I might be moving again, actually. Yep, I am. Oh, man. Dropkick slide. Oh, fuck. Red takes everybody out right in front of our table. Here comes number five, Striker. All I want to do is sit down and call a match. That's all I want tonight. We get some peace of quiet over here. These guys, I stay outside the ring for like an hour. Striker trying to take out TT Cruz. Red and Quiet Storm outside the ring. These guys are all over each other. These guys are, these guys are just destroying each other. Here comes Chi Chi Cruz. What's he looking for? Where's he going? I think someone's calling him in the back. He got a phone call or something. He's waiting for the next guy. To that is out. smart. He has no idea who it is. Our right? cameras aren't catching it, but he's waiting for the next guy to come Chichi out. Chichi Cruz is outside of the ring right now, by the ring entrance, waiting for whoever comes out to come out. There's action on three parts of the building right now. It's hard to keep track of. We have Red and Quiet Storm outside the ring. We have Adam Flash and that guy in the ring. Hey, this is in a lot of trouble. He oh, he got the Dex. He's getting slammed into the steel cage. Rob Echo's he's got slammed into the cage. It's going to be lit. We got Red down right. here on our table. We got Red on the table. Quiet Storm over there being thrown into the turnbuckle by Stryker. We need like three more commentators. No, we, we only need it actually. We need to lose one. Sorry to see you go. from Red. I tell you, Red hasn't lost a step. In fact, he's gained about three or four since the last time I saw him. This guy's making a true name for himself in the professional wrestling business. Wow, that goes getting lit up. Pile driver from Red. Oh, quiet storm. Storm. This could be driver. it for Quiet Storm. No, he kicked out of the pile driver. That was looked pretty rough. I think his vertebrae's coming out his left foot. Adam Flash going back to work on Red. Kick into the midsection. Adam Flash poised in the ring for whoever's coming in. From Appalachia Pro Wrestling, Jack Miller making his debut here in Pennsylvania. Wow, imagine if Jack Miller won this match. That'd be a big upset. Well, I mean, that's his credibility in the PWF. Three men left, Lou. Chris Devine, Gino Giovanni, and Jay Briscoe. I'm not yet made oh, Gino Giovanni? I love Gino Giovanni. I'm so excited to see Gino. But I can't call this. There's there's too much action going on. You know, I know you've never seen action like this I before. I thought you can never get too much action. Oh, I can't, but I mean, you can. But you've never had any. Striker goes for the cover on Storm. We got Adam Flash on top of the ring. He wasn't paying attention. No, he wasn't. This is what I mean. If I'm one of these guys, I go under the ring until I hear everybody gone. Gino Giovanni. Gino! Gino looking good! Okay. Oh, Rob Echoes falls on the top of Flash. They all pile on. Adam Flash. Get eliminated. Adam Flash. What? What do you mean he got eliminated? When did that happen? Hey, look, the future's so bright, I gotta wear shades. Oh, Flash getting some revenge. He should be out of here. Adam Flash 
Rushes to stay. Adam, stay out there. Stay you know, Giovanni there. trying to choke out Rob Echoes. Okay, see ya. Rob Echoes, Gino, yeah, because of Gino Giovanni, my man. My man, keep it on him. Keep it on him. QS, as we call him. Jack Miller with the handspring reverse kick. Nice move. Dino's chopping striker. Nobody's paying attention here. There's chaos everywhere. Now he's now he's chopping Chi Chi. Wait, I don't think Gino knows what he's chopping. Oh! He took his head off. Died. I want Gino Giovanni to win this more than anybody. the ring post. Jack Miller goes splat on the floor. Oh, storm. What happens if they're the last two? Jack Miller eliminated by Stryker. Well, not much of a debut for Jack Miller, but at least he was here. Ryan Storm is not taking any of Gio Giovanni's chops. He just hit a before to the face. Striker just slams down Cruz. Gino, get up! Get up! Gino, you want your glasses? Cruz goes for the covers. Quiet Looks like Cruz got the most of oh, Striker on that one. Those noises he's making are scaring me. You know who's left? Jay Briscoe. Yes, he is. <laughs> They're taking turns beating on Gino Giovanni. It's safe to say that Gino Giovanni's getting the crap kicked out of him. But I still love the guy. Now by three men. And here comes the tenth man. Somebody help Gino. Justine, just DDT, TT Cruz, TT Cruz is out. Oh, Gino's getting killed. What did he do to get so much heat with everybody? What did you do to me for? That's what I'm asking. Why do you gotta get his ass kicked? Gino suffered a beating since he entered the ring. Last month he said he wanted to make a mark and move up the ladder. So everybody's here, right? Everybody's in the ring. The only mark Giovanni's leaving. It's a blood stain in the mat. Somebody's busted open, but I don't know who. Submission by Strike Girl and Gino. How can he tap? How can he tell? Wow! Gino tap. No! I love Gino Giovanni. Red and Storm trading kicks. These guys are killing each other. Striker takes out Bricks. Go with him. Yeah, Strike is him. pissed off. Gino Giovanni still all over Quiet Storm. Yes. Oh, he hit him with the dreaded cup. Chris Devine whips right into the corner. He got Catches him. Home. He got him. Whoa, whoa. Nice Mexican arm drag out of the corner. <laughs> Climbs the ropes. What's he doing? Wow, I never saw that before. Lands on him. Quiet Storm is pissed off. Just scare the hell out Stryker's of him. Striker's not having it. He's gonna try to make him tap Can to the head. Can he submit outside the ring? Can he submit outside the ring? Peter's not even acknowledging it. <laughs> Divine going upstairs. Sunset flip from the top. Briscoe reverses. Nice move by Divine to sit through. Look at the bridge from Jay Briscoe fighting to get out of it. This is intense. This is intensity. He's trying to set him up for that Jay Driller. Trying to set him up for the Jay Driller. The fight's fighting to get out. He got out of it. For now. German suplex with the bridge. Briscoe's not done. Another one. Still not done. Briscoe is killing this kid. Three times. Storm. No way. Crystal oh. finds eliminated. Well.
welcome to Lava Life's Temptation Telephone. Right now, callers are recording their personal profiles and listening to other callers' profiles. Some are even chatting live. Sparks are flying as strangers are becoming friends. Let's meet some of the players. Sarah's in banking. Her passions include golf and golf. She's just met another golf fan and they're talking right now. Need some tips on your swing? Max makes up for his two left feet by working wonders in the kitchen. Right now, you could be swapping recipes with him. Renata runs a media company and is looking for someone to keep up with her. She makes friends fast and has been talking to so many people tonight. Mike heads up an IT department, loves animals, and romantic walks to the convenience store. Don't wait. Whatever you're looking for, a date, friendship, or fantasy, it's all happening right now on Lava Life's Temptation Telephone. Thousands of singles in your area are calling every day. It's safe, easy, and confidential. Plus, it's free to call. Temptation is calling. Call Lava Life now. Okay, so how this is going to work is, when I connect these wires, the electricity is going to cause a chemical reaction to simulate the... Eruption! The eruption, very good. If you're not helping after school programs, you're really helping to take them away. After school programs, wouldn't you rather be helping? Briscoe raises his shoulder. <laughs> Quiet Storm setting up for a neck breaker. No, he's getting him in the gory special. Into a neck breaker by Red. Nice inadvertent double team. I'm still shocked at what I just saw, to be honest with you. I'm kind of speechless right now. Our prayers are going out to Striker right now. Red going to the top, it looks like his best moves of his aerial assault, his quickness. He couldn't get caught by Briscoe, he just did. Send him up for here. I don't like the looks of this. I don't know what this is. Oh! Oh my! Jay Briscoe trying to take out this everybody. Could be for Red's reign. Red's title red could be over. No! And a breather. Oh! Kicked him See, in the head. This is a good move by Quiet Storm now. He's letting these two guys beat the hell out of each other. Go for a sunset flip from up there. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, good. Red, red. He got Let's go! We got him! It's time to red and quiet score! This match has been so physically draining, Luke. Everyone involved taking insane amounts of punishment. Oh my god, he's scaring me. Quiet Storm showing the intensity that makes him one of the top junior heavyweights in the world. He does not feel the pain, Lou. I don't know how he doesn't feel the pain. I, I think he should feel the pain. Oh my gosh! I mean, what's he owe red money or something? Oh, the shining wizard. Does he owe red money? I mean, seriously, does he owe him some sort of like funds, or did he lend him some money? They're traveling. No Red worked too hard. He doesn't want to lose that belt, Lou. Well, he could lose it right now. I could leave right now. And he wouldn't be able to find it. Oh, he's going for it. He was going for the storm. 
Cradle Driver. And Mike I Hughes think I think got his uh, lower eyebrow raised. I think he could be hurt. Oh, oh! And if Burnley Red takes out, is Mike Hughes in a match now to go for here? Oh, this is like a bear hug. Oh, Brain Buster, Cradle Brain Buster. He's going for it. No. Oh, German suplex with the bridge on top of his head. Oh, that was a slow count. Keener He's going for it. Simply lost his house. He's, He's going for a start cradle timer. No, red rolls through. Oh, it sits out on his head. Oh, my God. I think red's going to do it. Fight storm kicks out. Let's go for that infrared. He missed it. I have infrared sight. Roaring elbow takes Red off his feet. Almost a new champion. Almost a new champion. Red trying to hit that Red Star press. Oh, he misses it. He might telegraph that a little. Here it comes. No. I mean, these guys are just going back and forth. Oh, he caught him. Steel Cage is next, new champion, Brian Storm. I can't believe the action we're seeing tonight. Steve, what? This is important. What? Gino is back. You don't care. I just talked to LeGrand. He said, you don't care. Nobody cares. What's going on? I said I didn't care if he came back as a top commentator. As long as he didn't come back to the wrestling. Horrible. He makes fun of you. He makes fun of me. He makes fun of you.
awfully young. <laughs> there anyway. Nice drop kick. Connects. I like to talk a lot of trash.
want to party with you. Call 1-800-820-HOT for just 69 cents per minute. Wild local babes are waiting to connect with you right now. It's so wild, you've got to check it out. On management. Well, the only error I see is that you're letting your uh, people push you around and make you second guess your decisions. Of course, you're right. And now you're letting me do it. <laughs> <laughs> you want my advice? Yes. Well, I'm not going to give it to you. News Radio. 50,000 watts of pure comedy five times a week. 
be real. What did we see tonight? Tons of exciting PWF action. And you got to mention thanks to the IWA Cruel School for letting us use their facility tonight. This is an awesome place, Rob. It's amazing. I mean, if you think you got what it takes, why don't you give them a call and come on down? Well, you're in the weights. I didn't see you lift tonight. It's all too heavy as well. On this week's show, we saw Johnny Storm and Jody Fleisch just tear up the ring at Academy Hall. Can you believe the maneuvers they were pulling off? Ryan, those guys were in the rafters. It was crazy. Those guys are insane. The action was also insane in the Ultimate Rumble. Quiet Storm running through nine other guys to become the PWF Junior Heavyweight well, Champion. That match made him the man that he is today. The champion he remains. Wait. Brian, before I throw you off anything, next week, Steve Carino promised, and I know he wouldn't lie, that he's going to call my cell phone, and we'll have an answer about the whole Gino Giovanni situation for all the PWF fans. I guess we're going to hear about that next week. We're also going to see the confrontation between Jay and Mark Briscoe. We're going to see Quiet Storm receive the surprise of a lifetime. And Brian, don't forget, next week we have exclusive footage from the Zero One USA show in Japan. You're not going to see that anywhere else, only right here on PWF Pro Wrestling TV. Is it for you? There's no call yet? No, it's not calling. Maybe he'll call before next week, but for now, let's go to the ring for our main event, the Elimination Cage Match from Lockdown in Pottstown. He's going to call. Him. He promised. There he is. There's Jack. Jack and Guillotine. There he is, the three-time former PWF Universal Champion. Some handcuffs, you might want to be in that cage. Close that door, Finnegan. Finally, this match is ready to get underway inside the confines of the steel cage. Oh, this is so old school, Lou. I love it. I love it. This is how it used to be. These guys are going to grind each other's face into the cage, they're going to kick each other all over the place. You gotta. You won't see any high flying in this one, Lou. Oh! I think the cage broke on that. It's just brutality. Oh! Hammer bites the cage for the second time. Victor's getting his head ripped against it. I can guarantee you there's gonna be some crimson mass tonight. Victory. Well, it's kind of like Tyson likes to do. I mean, it's that whole biting strategy. CW tries to eliminate Hamrick. No deal. Victory's trying to escape, but it's not that kind of match. Jack's trying to go over the top. See, that is old school. In the old school steel cage matches, you can go over the top to win. And Jack remembers that from his 15, 20 years in the business. Six men walked in, Lou. Only two are going to walk out. They're tearing each other apart. Have you seen any blood? Is anybody bleeding yet? Doesn't look like it yet. Dylan Knight rakes the eyes of 
it seemed like Ryan. concerned about the outside safety of the fans trying to make sure that the cage holds I think Carino's busted open Chris Hammock is definitely bleeding Hammock's a mess oh power driver from Carino Steve Carino's busted wide open as well it's raking Chris Hammock's face on that steal And mass. Wow, this is a. Yeah, that confused me. I think they're bringing out some smoking some crack or something because I don't know where they got that finish from. If I didn't know anything, but I think Hamrick's going to be next. I mean, he's losing. Hamrick is a bloody, 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 bloody mess. a disaster. Carino is a disaster. Blood is pouring down his face. There's blood all over it. All over the place. It's a sheer brutality. Oh! Hamrick just an inch away from being eliminated. see the cage get dismantled like this. I've never seen a cage literally come apart. The force with which they're ripping each other into this metal. It's... All of these men have reverted to animal instincts. So Jack's victory is his blonde hair is now red. And it's not a die job. He's cut open. Super kick. Gitsy Legrand is busted open. Everyone is bleeding except for C.W. Anderson. Can we see Victory align himself with Chris Hammer? He seems like Grant's got to get out of there. He's been eliminated. He's not refusing to leave. Hammer and fighting at the top of the cage. of enemies now. We've already seen the old school heroes explode. But 
This is different this time. This is totally different now. Into the cage. Victory's a mess. Carino's a mess. Hamrick and Anderson are a mess. They're in not, they haven't even been able to leave the cage yet. Look at victory. This is could be it. This is crucial. Jack Victory needs to stay on Steve Carino right now. Believe me, I know these guys better than anybody. They're gonna put up a fight to the end. Big clothesline by Victory. He's going for it all. Look at Carino's head. Look at his head. Guillotine is still at ringside supporting Jack Victory. I think I might be bleeding. LeGrand will not leave ringside. Getting the crowd behind him. They love Steve Carino here. It's one of the main reasons the PWF has been able to function for so long and stay in business. Oh! DDT makes a quick cover. He got it. Jack Victory's been eliminated. in the ring with the PWF title, cheering on his man Steve Carino, and of course C.W. Anderson, the enforcer. Steve Carino is a bloody mess. for each other a few minutes ago. Havrick levels CW with his own belt. We have a new alliance between Victory, Havrick, and Louis Dangerously. He's whipping him with a strap. Victory's got a belt too. can get in. believe what I'm seeing. Oh my God, what in the world do we have in store July 14th here at Academy Hall? Dylan Knight trying to get into the cage, the Maximos, Chris Devine, Jack Miller all trying to get in the cage. Louis now CW with his own belt.
for America. People are throwing at their table.